Hi, this video will help you to resolve the following error when you use a Microsoft Access database, which says, okay, runtime error, for error 40, error number is 3043, disk or network error, or it says your uh, file is corrupt uh, and that you have a problem with the database. And it will look like this, that you have uh, something like this ODBC driver ID error and something like this uh, the column is wrong hashtag 207 ODBC driver something with with a driver or like this one or this if you have your SQL server but also on SharePoint and all that other stuff you get always the 400 uh, the network error or disk or file format error uh, file error uh, corrupt name <clears throat> so you find it always also somewhere here on the network and when you go to Microsoft Access and uh, Google so the error the problem is that when you have a database uh, on a server like SQL Server or SQL Express Server or um, or MySQL Server then as soon as somebody changes a table or when the connection to the table uh, from your local client to your table uh, to your server goes wrong or maybe cable uh, or something with a speed is wrong then you get this error or if somebody works on that database and renames on the server itself uh, a file uh, a field for example and then when somebody tries to uh, to open the file you see this one uh, this is wrong there's a name 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 nothing else okay so I have written this uh, correction code and I show you what you have to do the, the problem is uh, that you have to refresh this little arrow on the left side which says okay this uh, table is not on my local it's not my real table it's a bound table and you may refresh it you may go there to your uh, there's a, a manager for all those links or you see this link below you may try this one with a link refresh so let's see if it works now in this case it works and uh, you may also t take this one the manager there and the manager has all the other uh, links which are here defect you may refresh those links in this uh, block so here go in here and say uh, something with refresh here refresh um, this one the second one take it and there's a string which goes to the, your uh, ODBC or to your SQL server something like this and this says okay there's a table an external table and this has a local name and uh, works with this but uh, as soon as you have this problem uh, on uh, many times you may need some code for this and so I've written this small code in VBA uh, Visual Basic and now where's the code um, go there now you need this code for your um, for your service and you will find here the code which I have written which says okay when you are there we repair the table so you, we do the same we say for each table in your current database on the table devs that this that's this uh, list you say there uh, uh, look for the connection which is in there and if there is no string then this is a uh, if there's no connection so it's a local table or if it's a, a, a system table which is not visible then do the table refresh link this should work and it, it should refresh uh, your tables so this is when I when you open this system uh, repair formula and you push that button you will see here okay reconnected table and then now this it's only this table but it says that it's done and it will have here so on the uh, application bar some code which says okay table one table two table three and I will push that stuff to my website as always you will find it somewhere here on the code doku I'm writing it in there and you may take that code uh, and use it for 
preparing your database, uh, even if you have uh, SharePoint, for example, or, or the other uh, remote tables. Now, and where is my link?